Hi, hi there. Right, um, forgive me if my modulation is a bit powerful. Uh, for some reason, I don't seem to be able to get my desktop microphone to work properly, so I'm having to go through the um, the, the microphone on my webcam, and it's very, very, very loud for some weird, weird reason. Anyway, I want to show you something on uh, on my SDR, and it's um, it's the difference between a beam and a five element um, mono band um, Yagi and uh, why and why a lot of us like to use beams and, and the difference it can make. Um, I'm using an 11, 11 element opti beam which has five active elements on, on it which basically means it's it performs exactly the same as a five element mono bander. And believe you me, that makes a massive difference. Um, at the moment, I'm listening to, I think he's still there, there's a station down in Spain, right, not a million miles away. And I'm going to show you the difference between um, a vertical President Himalaya, which is on top of my tower. The tower's down at about 30 feet at the moment because the uh, weather's quite bad here in Brixham. But the the the, the uh, vertical is very high; it's just above the beam. Um, so we're gonna I'm gonna demonstrate the difference between the two. So I'm gonna put my volume back on, and you'll be listening to the guy on the vertical, and then I'll switch over to the beam, and you can just hear see the difference and hear the difference, right? So, so going over to the vertical, right. I think he, I'm not sure if he's talking. Hang on a minute. Here we go, he's talking now. You can't really hear him. That's the beam. Five elements. Wait till he starts talking again. Right, that's the beam. There we go, that's the vertical. There's the beam. You stop talking now. Conditions are really dropping on ten now. Not sure if it's not sure if the conditions have dropped away completely. Come on, Pedro. How are you? Back over to the vertical. Let's see if there's anyone else. You can hear the noise level. Right, that's the background noise level. That's on the vertical. Right, I'm going to go across to the beam now. Listen to the noise level drop. And you can see it drop there. That's because obviously a vertical is omnidirectional. The, the five elements being five, it's very narrow, so it eliminates all that noise. It's wonderful, really, really good. Back to the vertical. Watch the noise level rise. There you go. And that's why having more elements not only drops the noise level, but it enables you to pinpoint signals that much easier. Right, it looks as though, yeah, it looks as though the uh, band conditions have dropped. Anyway, that's just a little demonstration of a, a five element beam, a uh, mono band uh, beam compared to a vertical on 10 meters. Hope you enjoyed that. Cheers for now.